is our power transmission and circuit day, powered by Entergy. Uh, 10 years ago, the second Saturday in December 2013, we held our first STEM event in this gym. Today is the 10th anniversary of our first STEM event at STEM NOLA, and we're happy to say that we're here. We have over 150 kids signed up, registered, learn about circuits, learn about power, learn about transmission, and this would not be, power, would not be possible with many of our partners. I'd like to say thank you to Entergy, our sponsor for the day, who's been at the table with us for the last 10 years. Entergy powers life, and look at the life Entergy has powered through our children in STEM. Yes. All right, so today we're here at Joe Brown for our STEM Saturday where we engage the kids in circuits and electricity. And we're gonna get to engage in activities that involve circuits where they're gonna build a series and parallel circuit, and they're gonna build their very own project that involves them powering their own city, where they're gonna build their houses, connect the circuits to build the power lines, and they're gonna understand how power is generated and transmitted to their city through their circuit build. The kids are also gonna build a traffic light where they'll be able to build a circuit inside of the traffic light to power the different colors and create kind of a control panel to see how circuits and power flows through the power of their light. Our K2 kids are gonna build a flashlight where they're gonna put together a simple circuit to see how uh, light is powered, an LED light, by building together a simple circuit to create electricity. Time they, um, we do light bulbs light up and we're making, work with batteries to make this vibrate. I bring my kids here every month and today because it's a perfect opportunity to learn. He's interested in medicine and engineering and this is the place to be if you're his age. He's seven, he's been coming since before COVID so he's pretty much grew up here and he learns a little more every time. He's on the road to being an engineer and I think he's going to get there with the help of STEM Nolan. So he loves coming in every time. He gets so excited. He's the one who wakes us up early in the morning. So the day before, he's like, I'm gonna wake you up because we're gonna go to STEM NOLA. And he loves everything you guys do over here, so. I think this is an amazing event. This is an opportunity to take uh, aspects of technology that impacts us every single day. There's an aspect of today we're talking about power and energy, and this is something that we deal with every single day. But this is an opportunity to bring students in or young uh, people in to see how to actually build circuits, to see how things actually come together. Things that they experience every day, the effects of, but now actually knowing how it actually works, how it comes together. This is an important foundation to give them that experiential aspect so when they move on to really study STEM more formally in school, they have that experiential knowledge. the exciting opportunities that are available to them in the field of engineering. Engineering is so prevalent in our everyday life. Engineers design, create, solve important problems, and a lot of students don't realize the difference they can make in engineering. And so one of the things that we think is really important is for young girls to realize that they can be creative, they can make a difference in our world through the power of engineering. Tying the boards to, um, to the pins, then, then I'll hook up the battery onto the, um, onto the other pin. To, uh, you'll have a paper clip to be able to turn it turn it on. So this is the main part and all the power runs into it and these are the boxes that take in all that electricity. In this case they're just plastic and then it powers all the houses light. So yeah. I made a flashlight. Thank you Mr. T. Thank you Stimola.